does that even mean, Bowers Game? We are back again today for another Bauer Family Learns. I'm here today with my seven-year-old son, Luke. Hi. And we're learning Guess Who Junior. This is from Hasbro Gaming for two to four players. Age is three plus. There's two levels of play, even though it's kind of misleading because they're very, very similar. But we're going to teach you level two and level one today by playing level two and then explaining level one. So we got everything set up. We got our big stack of cards in this card thing right here. We have our five tokens, because each player is going to get five of these tokens. Now, the youngest player is going to go first, and the first thing you're going to do is you're going to roll this die right here. All right, so we are going to get two clues. They're either going to get a one, a two, or a three on this die, so we're going to get two clues. So what we do is we pop out the bottom two clues right here, and we say... It is green, and it lives in water. So there's going to be an animal out here that's green and lives in water. There might be more than one. And we're going to guess which animal we think it is. And we can go to the same spot. Now, get a clue token. And we're going to go one, two, three together, and then place it. So, ready? One, two, three. All right. So we both placed it on the same one. So now you can take the card out, flip it over. It was the turtle! Really? So... If, one of, if either of us were right, our pieces would stay on. However, since we're wrong, we get our pieces back, and then it moves to the next player on the left, and we do that until someone has all five of their pieces out. If you get it right, it stays, though. So we're going to get one clue here. Oh, my gooly. Goo, my gooly, gooly. It's brown. Well, that's a lot of things, huh? You're on three. One, two, three. I'm going with a fox. You want to flip it over? It was the bear. We're both uh. wrong again. Your turn. Now, in case you're wondering what's the difference between level one and level two, just don't get it out yet. Uh, on level one, you never use the die and you always get three clues. So it's way easier with three clues. All right. Okay, so. It's green. No, you get three clues. Oh. So you can just, yeah. You, can you read it? Um, It eats me. It lives in water, and it's green. All right. Three, two, two one, one, go. Oh, we both said alligator. Oh, yeah. So our pieces stay on there. Yep. And we're one step closer. All right, so I'll roll the dice. Three. So we can just get this whole card out. Doesn't have to hide anything. It has four feet. Lives on a farm, and it's pink. Ready? One, two, three. Three, go. Flip it over. Big. <laughs> we both got it. All right. Your turn. What if it's a tiger? <clears throat> well, that's a great question that everyone has right now. What if it is a tie? Hasbro decided that they weren't going to put that in the rule booklet. They couldn't be bothered to do that. They couldn't put the simple sentence, if there's a tie, players share the victory. They instead had to not answer that question. It lives on land and it's gray. Mm. Three, one, two, two one, one, go! Two. Yeah, buddy. I think you're supposed to place it. It's right there. You're going to put it right there. Because you're supposed to do it at the end of go. It's an elephant! Neither of us are right. But yeah, be please put it down a little bit more quicker. Okay. okay. And you don't have to start the three, two, one until you're ready, okay? Okay. Two. All right. So two clues. It lives on land, and it's yellow. Ready? Yeah. Three, three two, two, one, one go. go. Is it a lion? Or is it, oh, it's ah! a lion. So you take back your cheetah. Dang it. And then, yep. Oh, yeah. Three. All three clues. Let's pull it out. Can you read them? Um, it has feathers. It lives on a farm and it's brown. And then you start counting down when you're ready. Okay, let's see. Three, two, one, go! What the fuck? Yeah, chicken! No! Don't yell, please. Okay. Not on camera. Alright. Two. It's yellow, and it lives on land. Are you ready? Yes. Three, two, one, one go. go. 
it was the cheetah. No! I could have won and you could have cut up, but say la vie, it was not to be. Yes. Okay. Right. You like this game? Yeah. Awesome. Two. One, two. It is. It lives in water and it's gray. Hmm. Three, two, one, go. Oh, we gotta think it's a narwhal. It's a narwhal! Okay. So let's guess who, Junior. Uh, you can also play, if you want it to be a little bit easier, if you have younger kids, you can just play with just the red side or just the blue side. And then what you do is when you start up the game, you take out whatever color cards you need. Well, that's it. Let's guess who, Junior. What do you think about it, buddy? I like Do you think this is one you'd want to keep upstairs to play with uh, people sometimes? Yeah. Cool. Guess Who Jr., a feature finding game that grows with you from Hasbro Gaming. If it looks like it might be your cup of tea, be sure to check this one out. Also, if you're enjoying the content, please be sure to click on that subscribe button down below as we're trying to reach 17,000 subscribers in 2023 to make it our biggest year ever. And in the comments below, let me know. You got a question for the fine people, Luke? What animal would you want to add if it wasn't already in there? Mmm, what animal would I want to add? Well, let's take a look at all the animals first. I think the animal that's really missing from this is humans. So I would like one right here that just says Todd. Oh my. And Todd gosh. will have a green shirt on. I said animal. Oh, He's a mammal, bro. Fine, if, I, if you just want straight up animals, I will take... The dog. That was a boring answer. I'm ashamed of myself. I'm going to go honey badger. What are you going with? Flying squirrel. Mm, I do love a good flying squirrel. Let me know in the comments below what animal are you adding. Not human, though. And as always, thanks for your time, YouTube. This video is brought to you by all of my amazing Patreon supporters, and I would love it if you would join their ranks and have your name immortalized in the end of many of my videos for the end of time. But consider for only a dollar a month, and as always, thanks for stopping by.